We're standing here at display number one in Dinosaur Provincial Park in Alberta, Canada. This is a fantastic display that's here in the park. Um, and what we see inside the glass, it's protected from uh, the elements, but we have a hadrosaur. Um, so one of our big duckbill dinosaurs, the fossil is left in situ, which means it's still in the rock. And we can see um, arm bones, leg bones, the ribs and the spine and the tail. They're all still in life position, which means we'd say that's articulated. The bones are all still connected um, and we can see them lined up here. Um, the reason this display is here is so we can learn from it and we can see what it would be like after we've dug through and exposed these bones. Um, the reason this was left in place for us to learn is that this hadrosaur is missing its skull. And so without the skull, all of the hadrosaurs look the same. Um, and so it was left here as an educational tool so we could take a look at it. It is really fantastic. You can see all the bones in position as they were. Again, arms, legs, the spine. There are skin impressions on the tail and on the front a hand that you can see. Um, and it allows us to learn a lot about what it would be like to spend all that time digging and digging and uncovering this fossil only to find it missing the skull. And then you can't get it down to the actual species identification. But again, still a pretty cool find and definitely worth checking out here in Dinosaur Provincial Park. And as we look through, we can see the arm bones, we can see the ribs sticking out of the back, the leg bones here, and then moving through the back to the right, we can see um, the spine and the tail wrapping around. And we'll walk to the far side because there's actually an impression of the skin left behind um, in this uh, fossil. It's pretty fantastic to see. We're here on the far side of the fossil, same place, um, but as we peer inside, we can see this tail that's wrapping around. Um, and then really close on the floor, you'll see there's a pebbly surface. Um, that's actually the skin impression uh, left behind on this very cool hadrosaur.